Well, it is the first game back from the All-Star break, and the Red Wings get a win. Good to see uh, the Red Wings winning hockey games, especially with the Bruins being in a state of, um, let's just say they've been put in a position where they can lose a lot of games in a row. And if we win a lot of games in a row, while the Bruins lose a lot of games in a row, that gets us closer to the wild card spot that we've been chasing down ever since we lost it. So, hopefully we can capitalize on, you know, games like this and we play the Flyers again on Saturday. If we can win that, that'll be a big help. So, um, I mean, this game, Sider played very good defense. Ned was, was good for the most part. Um, Larkin scored, then Raymond scored. Then Pew scored, then Fabry scored, then Giovanni Smith scored, and then finally Vlad Vladislav Nemensikov had uh, an empty netter. Larkin's 23rd or 24th. Raymond's, I think, high teens, or maybe even in the 20s. Fabry's 13th. I know Vladdy got his 13th, and Giovanni got his his 5th, I believe. His 5th or his 6th. And then Pew, Pew Suter got his 4th, no, Pew got his 11th. Pew Suter got his 11th goal of the season. So, And the Red Wings, I checked this, we have 6 guys currently who are in double digit goals already in the year been a minute since i've seen that like it's probably this is one of the better red wings this is one of the better scoring teams that we've seen in a while because the past few years we've sucked really bad but luckily we suck not as much uh anymore or we don't suck as much anymore um but yeah this was a good game the defense in that first period was really bad and in the second period it could have had some improvement but in the third period, the defense really, really stepped up. Like, everyone, even Mark Stahl, was playing well. Our defense, they just stepped up. They stepped up to the challenge against the Flyers, and, and they won it as they should have, as they should have, because they fought for that win, and they definitely deserve that win. I'll see you guys next time. As always, I'm Not Funny, and tomorrow we got Purdue versus Michigan, 9 o'clock, a later game. But that's fine. And then Friday, we get to see Tyrese Halliburton debut for the Indiana Pacers. So we got some excitement coming up. And then the Red Wings play on Saturday. We've got some excitement coming up over the next few days sports-wise. See you guys next time. Just got unlucky with, on a few plays tonight, you know. One of, those, one of those plays, I thought he was standing still. But he just hit the shit out of that one guy. And the guy went flying. They blew the whistle. And they called it on him.